Sharky Breath. He plays video games. Hello and welcome back to God of War. Now, good, true to my word, I am going to head towards the main quest, but you know how it is whenever I travel stuff tends to happen, so I figured I'd get started here, but otherwise, I'll see you when I get back to a main travel hub of some sort. I could probably take a gate out of here or something, huh? Anyway, yeah, I'll do that, but I'll see you when I get back on track. See you soon. Maybe. Hang on. Come hmm? here. You called Brock and Sindri the Holger brothers? He did. Hi. But they're dwarves, aren't they? Hi. And Holger are sprites of the forest. Oh. Hi. Beautiful, seductive sprites of the forest. Uh huh. So why would you call Brock and Sindri the Holger brothers? Oh. Well, I now realize this would be a wholly inappropriate story for young and innocent ears. Uh, he's not particularly innocent at this point. Whatever. Okay, cool. No more information about that, huh? Brock and Sindri are dwarves, but for some reason, people call them the Huldra Brothers, after the beautiful forest sprites. Apparently, I'm too young to be told why. That doesn't require a great deal of an imagination there, Atreus. I guess once you're old enough to make the connection by yourself, they'll tell you the story. Whoa, I went through the door. Anyway, here we go. Hmm. I confess I'm curious about the realm of fire. And if the... It seems like I'm going to be unlocking other uh, codices as I go along. So maybe I should try and access the realm of fire? I, I might just be a terrible liar about this whole actually getting stuff... Main, uh, main plot stuff done. I apologize for that, but doesn't it seem like I should probably access the, the the realms that I have access to? I don't know. Maybe. Let's um. Let, let let's at least give it a shot. Because I'm curious. I'm so desperately curious. All right. What? Oh right. That's the 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 sigil I've got now. The the. Oh. Okay. Um. So you're telling me to. Switch it to that one that just started glowing, probably? This one here? Muspelheim Realm Available. Okay. Uh, yes! Travel to that realm, please. I know I've been up on a mountain for a while now, but since when do the dead not stay dead? It's a fair question. A resurrection among friends is one thing. I can hardly complain. It's true. But it's if hell itself is shambling into Midgard. Yeah, a little bit. I said the world was out of balance. Considerably. That somebody meddled with forces. Uh -huh. well, that's plain to see. Yeah. And Odin is the king of meddlers. I guess. But I shudder to think what he did to cause this. Yeah. Perhaps it involves the Valkyries. That'd be playing a dangerous game indeed. I see. Oh. Just a second. Mimir on the dead. Even Mimir doesn't know why there's so many dead men walking around Midgard, but he suspects Odin's meddling and maybe the Valkyries. Okay. And that the last Valkyrie, uh brazier that I went to actually required a different language than the first one, so I actually need to unlock all the languages to, to activate all the Valkyrie braziers probably, which then would do something at their council, I have to assume. Alright, this is happening. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Muspelheim. Muspelheim is the one that I unlocked, right? Uh, it says two meters to my goal, so probably. And also, everything is glowing red, which does suggest we've made it to the realm of fire, doesn't it? Alright. All right, sure. What could go wrong in the realm of fire? Oh, you know what? I have enchantments for this sort of thing. Hang on a second. Book by 13. Wow. Tears Shard is super good. Let's use that. Let's get Anvari's soul out of here. It's not actually something that's useful to me. And more luck seems good. I don't know. I came in here to do fire enchantments. Let's let's actually do that. Go to sockets. Runic on accessible parry. Never use it. I'm too terrible. Uh, burn damage. Resistance to burn damage. Good. And in the war belt. Health burst on successful parry. That still seems useful. Oops! I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. Taking damage. Da -da -da. Let's see. Did it just take it out of the other piece of armor? 
It did not. So now I have two of them in. So now I have 85% uh, burn resistance. Let's go with that for now. It's less important that I get the health bursts if I'm not taking the fire damage to begin with. All right, cool. Let's um, open that door. Yeah, this seems a lot less friendly than... Oh, well, actually, it seems pretty normal now. Ah, uh, but very fire. Very much fire, yes, okay. Hi, Brock. How you doing? You must like the heat, Brock. Heat's damned useful in my line of work. No doubt. Even makes space itself more pliable. Really? Take those magic doors you love so much. Do I? Around here, they all go right to one another. No prodding from old Brock. Really? Go up yonder and wake some up. You'll see. Getting around moose pulls or six. That is useful. You don't end up cooked. Right. Yeah, that does seem important. So let me see if I have this right. You and Sindri made me own you. Apparently. Yep. And then Thor used it to kill a lot of people. He does that. Your damn point? Just seems like you're mad at each other about it, instead of being mad at Thor. Yeah, probably. Kid, I like you. But you don't begin to appreciate the complexities what develop between family. I guess. You don't hear me lecturing your old man how he ought to be raising you. You probably and should believe be. believe me, there's plenty to critique. Ah, there you go. Sorry, Brock. Just trying to help. I guess. Yeah, that's enough of that conversation, apparently. Cool. Great. Well, that went fine. Um, let me see here. Can I actually use it to go someplace else, or do I need to discover someplace else before I can do that? Probably that ladder, huh? Yeah, just Brock's job. Whatever. Whatever is fine. Whatever is fine. All right, let's just get going. So let's just get going. Wow. Lost language complete. The realm of fire. It's hot here. Really? But is that snow? Is it? Ash. Ash. It only falls like that for great fires. Yes. The whole realm is a great fire. The source of fire itself. And all the sun and stars, if legend is to be believed. Neat. Should we believe? Should you? I mean, we're here, and we're not on fire. Uh, not, not yet. yet. Well, you <laughs> yes. know, I suppose it's cooled considerably since the dawn of creation, hasn't it? I would hope so. Niflheim isn't exactly ice these days, either. Mm, it's fair. in the nature of things. Extremes are tempered by time. Entropy. Fires burn colder, men grow old and grey. I guess. Heads are chopped off and attached to belts. Such is life. It seems to be... Uh, okay, Mimir. You have an interesting view on fate, my dude. Um, so everything's on fire. Should I be concerned? I'm not sure. Hmm. Yeah, this seems like it's not going to be a great, great place to be wandering around, honestly, but, uh... Well, let's check out the docks. Maybe there are boats. Maybe I can somehow use the boats in that. Oh, I can't even get down there. <laughs> okay, what was this? What you got? Hack silver. Of course you do. Let's check the other dock. It's probably just got another stash of hack silver. But, you know. Hey, look at that. Not even. Great. That's one way to avoid allowing me to try and boat in a lake of fire, I guess. These statues seem different also, but I guess we are in a different realm. Hmm. I can't really remember if they're different. They might be the same, but the lighting is different enough that it looks different. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Uh, hmm. I think I'm wasting time over here. Let's just keep moving. It seems to be fairly linear, all things considered. But, you know, secrets tend to be around corners and such. Well... Not this corner, apparently. But the, the principle still stands. Man, there's nothing here. Maybe it's because the entire place is on fire or something, but nothing is here. I would figure there'd be at least, like, some fire creatures or something, but apparently they're going easy on me since this is the uh, entrance way or something. Let's just keep moving, I guess. Hello. I'm not sure what I'm doing here, but I'm here. Hello. Uh, hi again, Brock. Wow, you get around. I mean, we knew this already, but... Hidden area discovered. Not particularly hidden. Muspelheim. All right. Sure. Uh, map. Great. All appears to just be a big old fire crater, doesn't it? Fire craters. <laughs> Not even funny. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, this is one of them lore things. Why is there a wooden, here. A wooden lore cabinet in Muspelheim? Must be a fire giant. I mean, I assume. Aye, the first and original. Okay makes a flaming sword a weapon of legend okay he fights thor and odin how did that go for him is that the past or the future 
Hmm. That may be a matter of perspective. Most things are. More than myth. Okay. Oh, right, right, right. That's just the, the, the task, not the actual lore thingy. Give me the lore thingy. There it is. Surter. An ancient fire giant of Muspelheim. He forged a fort of uh, he, he forged a fort of fire. He forged a sword of fire and fought, or will fight, Thor and Odin. That's pretty much the information we already got. So thanks for summarizing, kid. Um this way, I guess. Maybe we'll run into Sorter. That would go great, I'm sure. We have a common enemy, right? We seem to be mustering our way to fight against Odin. Oh, this is a climb thing. I thought it was a door. <laughs> yeah. I hear a voice. Do you? Another elf? I don't think so. Okay, what do you hear? It's coming from up there. Oh, good. Well, that's where we're going. Mountain high. Climb the volcano. You got it. Probably don't touch that, though, huh? Probably don't touch that. Yeah, good. Good not. Good job not touching that. <laughs> ah, hmm, such a hospitable zone. I am rather lucky, aren't I? That it's just around this corner. In that sword. Be careful. Be careful. Oh. Be careful, man. It's a great big sword. Uh huh. It wants to know if we're ready to train. Are we? It might be. Sure. Is that the whole deal with Muspelheim? Is just train with the big sword? Ah. Complete the trials to unlock the next arena. Accept challenge, reject the call, warm up. Um. Warm up. Runic attack tells me the abilities recharge immediately. Return to the arena sword when finished. Okay. Oops! I didn't mean it! I didn't mean it! Stop being angry. Okay. Okay. So you're, you're not that tough. You're not that tough. Your frost weapon should be pretty good against fire creatures, you think, right? Eh, it seems to make no difference, but that's okay. Oh, hello. You're a level five. Maybe it's, uh, maybe it scales with my level? Could be. Uh, that one's a level six over there, too, huh? Yeah, I guess it is. Okay, cool. Well, all right. Runic ability recharge immediately, I said, right? So I should probably be taking advantage of that. Great. And... A one for you. There. Uh-huh. I didn't actually hold it down to do the triple attack like I should be doing all the time, but, you know... Progress is progress. Here, have some more smashies. Have some more smashies. I'm feeling generous. There. And... There. Great. Do I have a talisman I should be using? Yeah, that's how it works. This is a, this is a warm-up, after all. I think I'm probably done here. I can grab this, though. Let's return to the sword. Hello. Great. And off they go. All right, sure. I accept your challenge. Let's see what happens. All right, so this one I can't actually stop. Kill enemies before time runs out. Gates closed. Gates closed. Boy. Yeah, all right. Yes, sir. What are we doing? We've got three minutes to kill 15 dudes. I don't see nothing. Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay, you. There. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a good start. This is a good start. It's a great start. Okay. I just did that dodgy thing that I keep forgetting that I can do. All right, kill this one. I see the time does not slow down at all while I'm in the process of doing a cinematic kill of a guy, so maybe that's not the best idea I ever had. Um, there's one. Okay, and there. Last one standing, labor complete, whatever that means. Probably just meant that I killed a whole bunch of guys. Good for me. That's three. It took me 40 seconds. Not doing super great, am I? Ah, come on, man. Come on, man. Just, just, just cut it out. Oh, hey, I almost died. Okay. That, that's a nice quick uh, auto kill thing, so please do that some more if you would. Just shoot the guy. Shoot the guy. He's right there. Oh, he's apparently attacking a dream. <laughs> I guess that makes sense. I guess that makes sense. Hello. Oh, there's two of them. Okay. Would you stop it? There we go. There we go. Perfect. And you? Oh, he's also stopped. Oh, great. Good job, Atreus. I didn't see what you were up to, but you did good. Um, another one, please? Another one? Oh, there we go. There we go. You. Uh, it's a big, it's a big heavy one. That's okay. I can do big heavy ones. Just like that. Just like this. And done so. Great. And you. Uh-huh. Oops, I probably should not be discharging into that attack. There we go. Okay, great. He was about to choke it, and I ruined it, but now we're back on track. Very good. Six to go. Hello, anyone else? Come out quickly, if you would. Yeah, no, 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 I hear it. I hear it spawning, but I wish that it would do it a little faster. How about this? Smashy, 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 smashy. Very good. And you. How about one of these for you? That seems good. That seems pretty good. 
It does do a lot more damage now that I have Runic going for me, so that's nice. Can I get angry? I can't. That's okay. It's okay. It's alright. It's alright. It's alright. It's okay. Okay. There. 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 Why are you so hardy? You really don't have to be, you know? Oh, these are the last three, though, so that's nice. I gotta kill that guy. There we go. Perfect. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Good, 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 good. Okay, and you. No, 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 cut it out, cut it out. Leave off on the boy. The boy is busy helping me. Thank you. All right, and that one. Oh, that one's nearly dead, isn't he? Oops. Okay, no, 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 please. There we go. There we go, perfect. Got him. I was a little crazy. A little bit. We went all right. Maybe. Wouldn't it be nice to find some incense just once? Oh, there it is. The smell of brimstone gets old quickly. I have an imagine. I I would imagine it does around here. Now then, open this up. What do we get? That was relatively easy, so I can't imagine it's much, huh? Smoldering ember plus eight. Okay, so that's how you get smoldering embers, or one way you get smoldering embers. You complete trials that the giant sword gives you. And probably I could do another one if I wanted to, right? It says there's another level to this challenge. Reject the call. I'm good for it now. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll try it later, probably. That was, um, like, that nearly took me the entire time limit just to kill those guys. And admittedly, this is one way to get better at fighting. But, uh, but, uh, I got, I got a volcano to climb, man. I got a vol I got stuff to do. How do I, hmm, maybe I should track that goal? Let's see here. Realm of... What? What? Was that it? Is that it for this place? Is that seriously all there is? Mystic Gateways, one of six. Okay, so no, that's not all there is. But maybe I have to complete more trials in order to advance further? It kind of seems like that might be the case. There's a whole bunch of these metal gates and whatnot. Hmm. Could that really be all there is to Muspelheim? Is it just a series of trials? It might be. Hmm. All right, well, in any case, cool. Did that, checked it out, seems cool. Probably should come back when I'm tougher. Uh, where's the gate out? Just a second. <laughs> I know I saw it on the map. I know I did. Oh, it's over there. It's over there. Over there? What? This doesn't make any sense. It says Arena 01. Oh, there are more arenas than one. And it's that way. I just have no sense of direction, apparently. So that's cool. Right, I passed... I probably passed it over... What? Huh. I'm apparently real bad at this, knowing my way around thing. Alright, this is the way I came in, isn't it? Yeah, I think it is. I think it is. I think it is. Well, you know what? Let's 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 skedoodle. This is this is just fighting, and I mean it's fighting for items that give you upgraded armor and whatnot. So that's cool and all, but but oh right, it's the gate that's by Brock. Well, that's fine. Let's let's not let's not let's not. I feel like I feel like I'll have plenty of opportunities to fight some dudes, and uh, I don't need to go out of my way for that. So let's just get back to the shop. Those two men with Balder. Uh, fair question. Are they really the sons of Thor? Aye, Magni and Modi. Oh, twice yeah. You won't likely find in the halls of Asgard. Okay. They'll do anything their uncle puts them up to. Sure. They're fools. Well, dangerous fools, to be sure. Well, no doubt, when because together, gods they're and all. formidable. Mm -hmm. But too often, it's a petty competition. Terribly I'm okay with strong, it. Even as children. Sure. I remember the time Hrungnir the Brawler fell upon Thor. Another time, Ed. Wh why not? <laughs> Oh, did you just wow. get shocked by the door? What? Hang on, hang on. On Magni and Modi, sons of Thor, helping their uncle Balder find a strong, dangerous, foolish. Mimir has a story about them and Hrungnir. Ask later. Okay. Sure. Will do. Well, you, you were just surprised by the door, huh? That's fair. It threw out of nowhere. Okay. We're back. Let's get fully back. Let's just, let's go back to the normal. Let's go back to the normal Midgard. I've got things to do and they're not on fire well let's look at what we know yeah Baldur is Odin's finest tracker bar none sure if he wants you you have to consider the possibility that Odin wants you sure and as for what Odin wants on this I have some expertise I have no doubt you what do could we have that Odin doesn't 
He's like the king of gods. The Aesir, I. Sure. But his reach is not unlimited. And where he cannot reach, he is preoccupied with going. Fair. He certainly tortured me enough about it over the years. I imagine he has. And that's all you have to say on the matter, because anything further... Mimir thinks Baldur is tracking us for Odin, who wants to go where he cannot reach. But we can? Yeah. Yeah. Anything further, and we start getting into territory that Kratos is hiding, because Kratos is far too defensive of his past, and uh, should probably learn to get over it, but it's not that easy. I get it. Anyway, on we go. Time for main plot, maybe, provided I don't get distracted again. Ha 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 ha. Mimir, is there a story for the giant with the flaming sword? Shoot the brave. Of course. Okay. We've spoken so much of cross giants. It's about time we instead met the most fiery giant of all. Uh huh. Back when Emir first emerged from Ginungagop, it was Surt who followed next. Still don't know about that name. He came from Muspelheim, the Fire Realm, bringing heat to the young cosmos, Got that conjuring mission? the sun from his primordial flame. Nito, was well, it on let's purpose? Come back to that flaming sword, shall we? Sure. Suart the Brave forged his sword of flame for one purpose alone. To burn down Asgard when Ragnarok comes at last. Ah, sure. His destiny is to fall at the hands of Thor and Odin. Well, right, but who wrote that so destiny? Doing, strike the blow that leaves their realm in ash and ruin. So basically everybody dies. And from that destruction, the world can be born anew. Convenient. Until then, alone he waits in Muspelheim, never sleeping. Ever honing his fiery blade? Sure. Brave, generous suit. Who knows he lives but to his doom. Mm hmm All because he chooses to serve a grand cycle so much bigger than himself. I can tell he's got a fan. To truly embrace your purpose and the patience and sacrifice it demands is to ensure your day will come. Okay. Do you think we'll be there when that day comes? This is exactly I've seen enough. Entry. Surtur. Prophecy says Surtur the Brave will die at Ragnarok, but take Asgard with him. Mimir says it's part of a grand cycle of death and rebirth, and Surtur accepts his fate. Apparently it's... war between the gods. Mm -hmm. But you, little brother, who can say? Hmm. Well, we seem to be heading that direction, don't we? I wonder if we're going to actually bring around Ragnarok, or if we're just going to disrupt it somehow with, you know, my, my god-killing tendencies. Guess we'll find out. Later. Hey, I haven't been here before, apparently. The Mason's Channel. Your H's are hard to read for some reason. All right. So what are we doing in the Mason's Channel? That looks like a dead end. Perhaps I have to open that gate somehow, but not at the moment. So on we go. Beach it. Over here. What we got? Hello? Anyone here? No? Well, all right. What? Another lake spirit? Are you serious? Taken from this realm too early. Man, you and your regrets all the time. Sure, sure, sure. What you got? You who walks among the living. You don't have to shout him right my here. My beloved Gulving calls to me. Who's that? She yearns for peace. Okay, cool. Yet her remains lie in pieces. Oh, nice wordplay. I beg of you, make my Gulving whole again. Macabre. You want us I to pronounce collect that her word bones? wrong, but okay. Gross. Yeah, pretty much. Gulving say their magic knows no bounds. Okay. She can reunite you with those you've lost. You think so? Really? How? Boy, I can smell your grief, child. That's Rest weird. Rest assured, her magic is strong enough to create bridges between life and death. But she's dead, right? If only for a short while. Great. Boy, we are leaving. Yeah. Nobody likes. Nobody likes. Um. Nobody They've likes them. Three of Sweet Gulvig's bones and spread them across the lake. I'm sure they have. Bring me her bones, child. Gulvig will reward you. I'm sure that she will, but we don't like wallowing in the past, kid. <laughs> Your mom's dead. I know where you're going with this, but your mom's dead. And we're probably going to do that side quest anyway. But your mom's dead, okay? Ah, good. What? A special chisel is ahead past this gate. Neat. Can it was to say what? Oh, yeah, right behind me is right. It's an ogre, probably. Yeah, it looks like an ogre. Are you fierce or are you not fierce? I guess we'll find out. I haven't seen one that looks like a titan from Attack on Titans, but that's what we got. Okay. Well, you do seem to be pretty ferocious, but I guess that's nothing unusual when it comes to, uh, comes to, uh, ogres. Here we go. Hmm. He's also a little beefy. And are, is that a dark elf? 
why are the Dark Elves assisting the Ogre? Oh, wow. Nice work, kid. I didn't know you could take over Ogres temporarily. That's very convenient. All right, have one of these, have one of these, have one of these. As many as I can possibly muster. There we go. Great, get out of there, get out of there. All right, let's charge up some of this. There, there, there. Very good. good. Yeah, no, I see it, I see it. We're fine. Ouch, hi, Ogre. <laughs> Listen, I'm dealing with an elf. Could you just hold it for a second? Okay, you. Okay, are these all summoners? That's real annoying. No, I don't think they are. I don't think they're summoners. They're just here to be irritating, and that's fine. Ogre, what you doing? Okay, there we go. There we go. I knew it was coming sooner or later. Is last, is last elf dead? Are the elves all dead? The elves look to be all dead. Well, that's convenient. Good job, Atreus, probably. Was that when you were controlling the ogre? Very well done. All right. All right, you. How we doing? Oh, more of them. More of them. Well, you know what that means. You know what that means. He's got to stun this fella. Oh, wow. He's just going to die, isn't he? Yeah, he just died. I guess I don't get to ride him. Well, that's okay. Good job, Atreus. Yeah. Wow. An actual compliment mid-battle. That's unusual. Okay, cool. Let's see. Do that. And there. And how about one of these for you? Seems good. Great. Okay. Where is he at? Over there. Very good. Uh, shoot, please. Shoot again. Very good. Okay. Okay. All right. I got this. I got this. We're good. And that was enough Dark Elves for my labor. You did well. Great. Man, you're still going, huh? Father, okay. Yeah. Maybe we should look for those bones. Why? Didn't you hear him? We could talk to Mom again. Yeah, that's what if I'm saying. It's not telling. Look if you we... wish, boy. I will not be distracted by this fool's errand. Yeah, definitely not. Definitely not going to be exactly distracted by this fool's errand for sure. Anyway, how about that seal? Good stuff. Good stuff. I've never actually killed an ogre without having to ride it around and smash its friends, but uh, it worked out. It worked out. So how about it? Are we hunting some bones now? Or are we going through the gate? Are the bones through the gate? Let's find out. And the task is, ah, uh, the bones are all that way. All right. Looks like we're gathering bones. Man, there are a lot of distractions on the way to, uh, to, uh, getting that chisel. <laughs> but I guess that makes sense. Given that it's a chisel that can, well, I don't know. It seems to be able to do a lot of weird stuff, but it's, it's magic, certainly. And, uh, given that chisels are meant to at least in a controlled fashion, destroy things. I can imagine that a lot of people would have opinions about me going and gathering it. I don't know what to do anything about that. That blue stuff. Never figured it out, but perhaps someday. Isn't this where I released the dragon? Odor, was it? I feel like it was odor that I released here. Oh, is that just is that just bones? Are the bones just going to be laying about? Apparently, yes. Stick these bones in my pocket. These bones pulse with magic. Neato. It must be Golvi. Could we... Can we just hold on to it? I mean, I did put it in Maybe my we'll pocket, so yes. The spirit lies to you, boy. Yeah, no doubt. How would you know? I have known many spirits. Yeah. They are all liars. <laughs> all of them. Different. I know it. Do you do you, you know, know it? Very little. Yeah, I mean, you're what? Trust the well? spirit to keep its word is foolish, boy. Yeah, I have a feeling this is going to end disastrously for all of us. But Don't that's you okay. Want to see mom again? Of course I. She is gone, Atreus. Yes, that. You must accept this. But it's a side quest, do, but so we'll get experience. So. To see her again, just one more time. Mm -hmm. Good job, Gavin. The golden padding, by the way. You do not know him or who he was. Uh -huh. All of this is sinister. It's true. He wants to see someone he loved again. Uh huh. I, I understand how that feels. I, I guess. Don't think dude. anything sinister about it. Oh well. Hope is blinding your instincts, boy. It's yeah, pretty much. But you know what? We're doing it anyway, so it's fine. Um, bones, bones, bones. Where could they be? Probably not too deep in here, huh? It's nice that they're all in places where I've already been. Um, was that a corpse that just faded? What's going on? Maybe I've been here more recently than I think. Let's see. Well, apparently they're quite nearby. But I sure don't see them. Ah, maybe they're up, up further. Could be up further. Leap. Bones, 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 bones. Oh, not this way, bones? Oh, maybe this is bones. Hey, it's a skull! They did scatter her about, didn't they? Gulvig. Bones. Yeah, what a little bit. you say to her? To Gulvig? Your mother. Yeah. What have you left unsaid? I... I guess... I just want to know if she's okay. 
I mean, she's, she's dead. She's dead, boy. I know that. I... You don't understand. Don't I? Neither do you. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. This is probably a really bad idea, the thing we're doing, but I'm fascinated to see where it goes. Morbid curiosity, you might call it. So on we go. Last bones, here we come. What would you say to me? Nothing. Nothing? There is nothing left to say. I guess. What about everything we've done so far? That man coming to the house? Talking to the world serpent? Uh -huh. We've done so many amazing things. I guess. I so just want to tell her about them. I can understand that, but... Don't you? What else would you say to her? I tell her that we're both okay. Hmm. Not to worry about us. Atreus, I... I miss her too. You know this. I thought I knew very little. I mean, objectively, yeah, but... Well, whatever. <sighs> whatever, man. We'll, we'll figure out what we're going to say to her soon enough when we get tricked by a spirit. It'll be great. All right. This way. Sure, it's handy that he knew exactly where the bones were so we can just track them on our, you know, locator business here like this. But uh, I guess I've commented on that enough, haven't I? <laughs> oh, hey, Ruins of the Ancient. I remember killing the guy who lived here. I guess that's kind of what I do. Hi, Bones. Get in my pocket. Oh, it's a hand. A hand, a skull, and a whatever that first thing was. That's all you really need, the right? Bone. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We might as well return them to the spirit. I guess, while we're Maybe at it. he will keep his word. I know she's not coming back, okay? Yeah. I know. I just... Never mind. I just gotta return the bones. Sure. With that attitude, that sounds like a great idea. Wait a second, that sounded like an Odin Raven. Just a second. Oh, there he is. There he is. There he is. You really should avoid making laser beam noises if you don't want to get axed. But, well, guess you didn't learn that lesson this time. <laughs> I wonder why Goofy's bones are all over the place. Well, somebody didn't want to brought back, clearly. Typically. Pieces of scattered corpse make for a piss poor soul. Hmm. No hope for Valhalla or Helheim when your arms on one beach and your heads on another. I didn't realize that. Ask the spirit. I'm sure he will be forthcoming with answers. <laughs> I love the crater sarcasm. I really do. <laughs> I am sure he'll be forthcoming with answers. <laughs> All right, back to the spirit. And here we are. All right, spirit, are we going to be underwhelmed or are we going to be attacked? Probably one of those two things is going to happen. Great. Let's get to it. Uh, circle. Treus? Wait, why, why can't I not? There it is. There it is. Here you go. Have some bones. I stuck them all in my pocket. I got deep pockets. We have collected the rest of your woman's corpse spirit. Yep. Have fun with Show that. Show us this magic you have promised. Ah, oh, my sweet Gulvik. Mm -hmm. Whole again. I guess. Rise, dear Gulvik. Awaken, oh powerful Gulvik. Yeah. So attacked then. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's gonna be a revenant, isn't it? She says she'll honor our request. Does she? And reunite us? Uh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Beggared. Yep, beggared. It's cool. It's cool. We got this. Oh, she got nightmares too, huh? Well, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine, Ghoul Big. It's fine, Ghoul Big. There, there. Shoot the other thing if you wouldn't. Thank you. Those are a lot more annoying for me to deal with personally. So say, oh, hey, you got a, you got a nightmare, huh? Yeah, 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 I'm on it, I'm on it, dude. I got you, I got you. Now then, shoot her, please. And there, okay, 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 cool. There we go. That seems like it missed entirely, actually. Whoops, that's the wrong button, sorry. Okay, all right, all right. How about, that's the wrong button. This is what I was intending, but you moved away, because of course you have, because you're a revenant, my friggin' favorite. Now then, now then. Oh, wow, she actually is almost dead. Maybe I did get her with all that. Uh -huh. I was too busy talking smack and not paying attention to her actually health bar. There we go. There we go. And one of these for good measure. Great. No head for you, no body for you, no nothing. Great. Right. Say it. Say what? I told you so. I mean, I did. I told you so. Yeah, 
There you go. And eh, we'll get to that later. Gulvig. A spirit convinced me that Gulvig, a powerful witch that was killed a long time ago, could reunite us with Mother. Father didn't believe him. I shouldn't have either, but for a chance to see Mom again, it seemed like we should give it a try, right? Once we collected all her bones, Gulvig was resurrected, and she said she'd reunite us in death, and then attacked us. We killed her, obviously. I was really upset with myself. How can I fall for such an obvious lie? But Father said to take it as a lesson, so that's what I'm going to do. No more trusting spirits, I guess. This is true as well. But do not take your disappointment out on me, boy. Take it as a lesson. Yeah. Yes, sir. Which is what the page said before I even said that, so that's... I guess I'm a little predictable. What you got, Gulvig? Anything good? Just a bunch of Hacksilver? Yeah, <laughs> just a bunch of Hacksilver. Well, that's fine. You got anything to say for yourself, spirit? Yeah, of course not. Well, I did that. I did that against all better judgment and... Kratos' own opinion. I did that. And so that's great. So next time, next time, we'll go through that gate. We'll go get the chisel. I'm sure it'll be just as easy as that. It'll just be lying there. We'll grab it. We'll be good to go. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time when we go get that chisel. Bye.